Welcome back to the Tool Crib. Today we are going to be talking accessories for Leatherman Multi-Tools and specifically we're going to be talking about a particular extension that may be in the works from Leatherman. So we all know about the bit kits which have been around forever. Uh, you, get, you can get a 42 piece bit kit which will allow you to add some extra capability to your Leatherman Multi-Tool. They come with the long time extensions that they've had. Now you can get these in either their, their stainless version or their black oxide stainless version. And with the release of the, of the SuperTool 300M, we got a new extension, this black oxide one that includes a sight tool. It also has a magnet down at the bottom so you can run your Leatherman bits or you can run uh, regular bits in this one as well. And so that was a welcome addition from the Leatherman accessories. Well, it does appear that there may be a brand new extension in the works from Leatherman, and this one would be a ratcheting extension, something that has long, well, a lot of people have implemented uh, a ratcheting extension into their, their uh, Leatherman multi-tools by using different off-brand screwdrivers. And uh, it's a very popular mod, and I'm kind of glad that Leatherman has, it looks to be, as if they are pushing towards uh, producing one. Well, uh, a, couple, a couple of days ago, I had one of my viewers who directed me to a website uh, where they were listed. It looked like they might have been listed prematurely. I think they're, they're scheduled to come out after the first of the year. Now, I went ahead and pre-ordered one, and it said the delivery on it was two to four months. So I decided to get in contact with Leatherman directly, and I got a I got in touch with their customer service department, which a, a nice, very nice lady helped me out. Uh, she was able to give me uh, an email address to someone in marketing who could better answer my questions. Now, unfortunately, their emails they don't uh, take unsolicited emails, so you have to be on the list. So it blocked my email. So I called back in, and the customer service again was able to help me. They told me that I could uh, just go through the regular channel, which is their info page, uh, their info email or info at Leatherman.com. And so I sent another email and I directed it towards the attention of one particular uh, marketing uh, employee there, uh, an employee in their marketing department. Well, they never got back with me, which is unfortunate. I was really hoping to, to hear back from them. Uh, my assumption was that this extension was not yet supposed to be released to the public and that the website that had showed it had actually done so prematurely. Well, I did notice, though, uh, the very next day I got an email from the company where I uh, made the purchase for a pre-order of this, and they had told me that, that my order had been canceled and that uh, it was no, and then it's no longer available on their website. So... My conclusion is, actually, I don't know what my conclusion is. It does appear that Leatherman does have this in the works. Now, obviously, they probably don't want it out in the public domain yet because they haven't had its official release date yet. I think that the only way to get any answers on whether or not this exists or if this product is going to be coming forward, as I'm hoping it will, would be to get in contact with Leatherman directly. Now, there was only this one picture that they showed on the website. There was no additional information, didn't give any details of, as to how much torque this thing could handle or what it was capable of, but it does appear to be an extension, a rationing extension that will work with the Leatherman bit exchanger and work with the Leatherman, uh, the Leatherman bits or the Leatherman bit kit. So I wanted to let you guys be aware of it, that this is something that may be coming down the line after the first of the year. Uh, I, sure, I sure hope so, because I know that this one will be a very, very popular option. And I like that Leatherman, if in fact they are producing it, I like the fact that they decided to go this route. My name is Ben. You've been watching the Texas Tool Crib. I appreciate you watching, and I'll see you in the next one.